I'm Storm Trek 8 Chief Meteorologist Ashley Brown expecting another stormy day in the forecast for you tomorrow, but tonight we're mainly dry. Temperatures quite warm compared to last night. We're in the 70s, falling down into the 60s in the overnight hours. Now, tonight mainly dry, but tomorrow is another day. We'll track showers and thunderstorms in the forecast. Isolated strong to severe storms possible throughout the day for you tomorrow. So let's track the system. We're going to take you hour by hour. We're going to start things out at around 2 a.m. So as we look off to the west, you'll see this storm starting to develop right as it moves in some scattered showers ahead of it. It slides over our area bringing showers and thunderstorms, heavy downpours of rain, gusty winds associated with the system as well. Quite a bit of lightning in the sky and rumbles of thunder. See, this is another system that as we watch it, it weakens as it slides off to the west and east and moving pretty quickly throughout the early morning hours. So prepare for another damp morning commute for you tomorrow morning. So you're damp to start your day tomorrow drying out by afternoon, but we'll keep the chance of showers and storms on and off throughout the day on your Thursday. That severe potential stays with us throughout the day as well. As we look at the temperature trend, even warmer tomorrow. Today in the upper 70s and low 80s, tomorrow many areas in the low 80s. So this warming trend continues, but what you will notice is the humidity really climbing, not only tonight, but you'll feel it more so tomorrow and really feeling a warm and muggy day on Friday. As we head into Friday, Friday, I think some isolated showers here and there throughout the day. It's not a wet day all day. You'll have several dry hours on your Friday to enjoy. Once we get to Friday night, we'll dry out once again ahead of Saturday's stormy weather that will come our way. Friday will be the warmest day of the year so far with temperatures in the 80s at 87 for Indianapolis, about 81 for Kokomo. So far, the warmest day last Saturday at 85, so even warmer than that on Friday with humidity. The weekend forecast headed to the 500 festival parade on Saturday. You're going to deal with some scattered showers and storms and for the race on Sunday, the best chance of storms is mainly in the afternoon, so you may start the race a OK, but that chance of storms with us and increasing throughout the day on Sunday. So showers and storms with temperatures in the 80s that will continue into Memorial Day or holiday there on and off. This is not a washout, which means you'll have some dry hours to get out on the holiday. Temperatures continue to hold steady in the upper 70s and low 80s for much of next week with several chances for rain.